Yo guys, we are back again with a new video. Here we are trying to play Minecraft for free and creating our own server where we can play with our friends also. So let's get started without any delay. So first of all, we need to go to the browser and search for the T launcher. You might have heard about it earlier also. So just go to the T launcher. Here it is click on the t-launcher download minecraft launcher make sure to download it from their official website otherwise you will get some viruses as well so just go to their browsers and the main page and search for t-launcher the launcher for minecraft okay just go to the download option there is an option for windows mac and linux also but today i am going to use it for the windows so just click on the windows and the download will start it as it's already downloaded i have already made it to the another window or you can say folder so here it is this is the t launcher 2.8 installer 0.7.1 you just need to install it so let's go install it yes and here it is and for this you need to have java also just click on the continue and it will install in a few minutes here it goes it's installed already installation complete click on complete and a new window of t launcher will just open here here it is as you can see so in here you can see many more options like just released latest release of 1.17 you can also see release 1.17 but i recommend you to use the option where tl is written like tl release 1.16.5 tl release optifine 1.16.5 because if you're using t launcher where TL is not written then you will face many more problems in here like you can't uh, play with the free servers and all the things so I will go for the Optifine 1.16.5 TL install it will take a few names so I need to write some name here so I write down my name here you can write down anything doesn't matter and done installing it will take some few minutes let's go till then you can subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos and uh, about a minute and it will install let's go After this is being installed, we will go to the Eternos where we can create our server. So let's till then it's installing. We can go to the Eternos and let's see how to make a server. So search for Eternos. I've already searched it out. So just click on Eternos. You will find it at the top just click on atanos.org click here go drop down to the bottom and click start here it will ask for sign up so if you don't want to share any information you can just click on the sign up type in any username like i want to type goldie rocks so accept accept you don't need to share any kind of email or anything because email is optional just create any password for now so i'm gonna create this one here it goes so email is optional so you don't need to share any kind of personal information and anything so just go for the sign up part it will ask for the verification done 
now second part before going to a create a server option it should be installed first if t launcher is not installed then we can't continue further because we need its file to go on and create a server so till it's installing just click on a create a server option here it is the option for this one is how which version you want to create a java edition or a bedrock edition so we are going for a free edition so java edition will be required so click on java edition and then click on create here it goes and as you can see we are here but before clicking on the start button we need to figure out some things here as it going to stall so before it gets done you need to go in here in the worlds and we need to upload our world first but for that we need to create a world in here in a single player mode so just waiting for it to be installed let's go make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you are new guys thank you so much If you're not understanding any kind of part you can just slow down video pause it out and follow same to same steps or drop a comment and i can help you there also i can reach you to you anytime just drop a comment i will reply to you whenever i come like Just two minutes remaining. Install, 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 install. And yes, I am saying it once again. You need to download version of Minecraft where TL is written. TL, TL is for T Launcher. So if you want to play with your friends, you need to compromise something. And here it is, our Minecraft is being started. And like that, our Minecraft is here. So just go to the single player mode for now. Like a new world. It is. It doesn't matter what new name or what default you are having here. Just click on create new world. And it's just installing for now. And done. We are here. And it doesn't matter where we have spawned. We just need to save it. So save, save and click to title. Here we are. Quit game for now. It's very important. Even if it's open, it doesn't matter. Just drop it down here. Now we need to find its file location. So click on the folder we have created. So here it is. We just need to go to the saves. Just go to the saves option. Here it is. We have created a new world name new world so just copy it out copy now go to any folder where you can find it very easily so i have created one folder like minecraft here so i'm gonna paste it here here it goes our my new world is here now click on it create its zip copy so send to compress zip folder in here you can name it anything so new world is okay because however where whatever you give the name in here it is gonna be deleted so it doesn't matter so i have named it new world now we need to go to eternos so eternos is here now we need to upload a zip archive that will be our 
folder in here so let's go to the minecraft folder i have made here it is i need to upload the zipped folder okay so new fold new world zipped folder open and it's getting uploaded and done now as you can see the things being changed download upload generate these options has already came in here now we need to go to the software part in software part we need to click on the vanilla edition so vanilla as you guys remember we have downloaded 1.16.5 version as you can see in here optifine 1.16.5 so we need to install 1.16.5 just click on that thing and click install and done uh, installation is completed now it's very simple just go to the server but before click on the options first because we are using a free version so here we need to click on the cracked one click on the cracked it's very important thing otherwise your server will not connect so you need to click on that cracked version for sure because you using t launcher you have not, not purchased it from the minecraft so you need to click on crack the thing here you can also change the options for slots how many slots or person you want them to join like 100 200 it's your wish whitelist your blacklist it's your wish what mode you want to play just you can change it early on or later as well so it's your wish so for this you just need to show that you have clicked on the correct thing then just go to the server part and click on start all things are completed just click on the start thing and it will ask for your permission give yes okay and done it's now loading it will take around one to three minutes but make sure here it is software vanilla and version 1.16.5 is written so it will give you authority that you are using direct server and your friend also needs to be on the same version otherwise they will not be able to join in so we are waiting for us to connect but before that is connecting enter the game till then so that whenever the server connects you are ready to go because the problem with this free version is the server will will be open for five minutes <coughs> or to six minutes and it's go on forever until anyone is playing if no one is connecting to the server or no one is connected to the server in the time period then it will just turn off automatically so if you are gonna play just be ready so it's generating as you can see so when it's ready to go we can just go on and play it here now we just need to go on the multiplayer mode so we'll show it again and we'll add the server directly was it connecting it will say start hmm, waiting 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 and done here it is we are online just click on the connect either you can use the dynamic ip i just using dynamic ip for now just go to this this one add server you can name it anything like I'm gonna make it name Goldie Rock and just paste the server. Simple and click on done. As you can see, we are already connected and just click on the start. And here we go. We are on to our own very own server and you can share your server link with your friends and they can join in like just clicking on the multiplayer and going on back there so here it is you can join in anytime but the small deficiency for this one is that you will have to be online if anyone is connected then the timer will not be running i will show you once again like i have joined in 
again so it will start showing one player is connected so till we are connected it will not show any timer you can play it for 24 by 7 doesn't matter and here's the option where you can create players just click on the players you can make anyone op operator you can whitelist there's many more things if you if anyone annoying just join your server you can kick him or you can just ban him out ban players ban ips whitelist all the things are in here where you can just manage your minecraft server like you want so just this is it you can just disconnect it and it will just turn off automatically so t launcher is the one thing you need second thing is you need Atronos and at the last you just need me to follow so guys this was it for this video and i will see you guys later on with another interesting video till then enjoy minecraft with your friends and create your own server bye bye take care and peace out guys have a good one see you later on